Welcome to Millionaire's Business Wealth Secrets YouTube channel. India's Money Magnet It took three decades for him to stand against the might of the West and it was 2020 when he went on a head-on collision with Amazon and Walmart and beat them down in India as a commodity sale platform. Many do not know his name. Here comes Mukesh Ambani. Named the 10th richest man by Forbes in 2022. Mukesh Dhirubhai Ambani is known as the executive chef of India's biggest private firm named Reliance Industries. The volume and vastness of its work can be estimated by the simple fact that it is included in the Fortune 500. It is not an astonishing fact as its chief is also South Asia's first wealthiest person to get included in this list of 10 the wealthiest persons on the planet. Early Childhood Mukesh was born on April 19, 1957, in Aden, colony of Aden, now Yemen. He attended a Bay Mariska school in Mumbai and graduated as a chemical engineer from the Institute of Chemical Technology in Mumbai. During Indira Gandhi's administration, the floodgates to PFY, polyester filament yarn, manufacture were opened to the commercial sector in early 1980. Dhirubhai's father had sought a license to launch PFY, and he was awarded the license against stiff opposition from the Tadas, Burles, and 43 other families. Mukesh stepped out of college to assist his father in the development of the PFY business, which marked the beginning of Reliance's backward integration from textiles into a conglomeration of vast industrial sections in 1981. Passion He has been passionate about business and entrepreneurship since adolescence. The struggle for conquering the peaks of dreams started in 1986 with the establishment of Reliance Communication. The petroleum industry was the next venture on this path in which he set up an oil refinery in Jamnagar. Mukesh's Reliance Industries business is spread across various sectors. He owns various oil and gas companies. Mukesh Ambani was the first Indian to meet with US President Barack Obama. Mukesh partnered with the well-known Indian media transmission organization Airtel and began making swift investments in a company named Geo Broadband. Ambani, in 2016, ultimately launched Geo with 4G, offering the industry's lowest costs. Mukesh won the industry by making competitive and advantageous offers. Meanwhile, as a result of Geo's success, other competitors have been forced to deliver their products at lower margins. Geo Broadband attracted 1.5 billion customers in just 170 days. He developed one of the world's largest and most complicated information and communications technology endeavors, Reliance Infocom Limited, which is currently known as Reliance Communications Limited. He grew Reliance into a conglomerate with diversified sectors in petrochemicals, retail, telecommunications, energy, textiles, and natural resources throughout India. Currently, he is experimenting with retail and e-commerce. Reliance became the first Indian firm to attain a market valuation of $100 billion under Mukesh's leadership. It is also currently the most profitable firm in India. He has risen to become Asia's richest man. Apart from the business, he owns the Mumbai Indians 2020 group, a cricket crew under the Indian Premier League, IPL. He has been lucky thus far in this venture as Mumbai Indians have won the IPL trophy five times, more than any other team. Next, we will look at his awards. However, before we continue, we request that you subscribe to this YouTube channel. Also please click that like button, it helps spread the word. Thank you. Awards Mukesh Ambani, one of the world's most respected business CEOs, has received several awards for his leadership abilities. A list of these awards includes He was Ernst and Young Entrepreneur of the Year in 2020. Dean's Medal in 2010. The United States India Business Council Leadership Award in 2007. Chitralika Person of the Year Award in 2007. World Communication Prize in 2004, and many are yet to come. Mukesh Ambani's net worth is expected to be $95.1 billion as of 2022. Mukesh often says, data is the new oil, indicating a change in his focus on the computer business. Controversies Like every rich man, he also remains part of controversies. In the years 2021 and 2022, the name of Mukesh Ambani has remained very controversial due to his political ties with the ruling political elite. It was once alleged that Mukesh Ambani is running the government. 
India Against Corruption, IAC, leaders stated that RIL's oil extraction contract in the Krishna Godavari Basin had flaws and that the business was taking advantage of them. Conclusion Mukesh Ambani is one of the world's most respected business CEOs. The climate crisis is essentially an energy crisis, the excessive use of fossil fuels in the past 200 years has gravely endangered the fragile ecology of the planet. These words are not of Elon Musk to win more support for the futuristic plans of his Tesla but of Ambani who has announced plans to invest in electric cars in India. This venture will not only make him stand against Elon Musk but also propagate his image as an Eastern Elon Musk. Mukesh Ambani will continue to be the business icon of every young Indian who aspires to emulate his achievement and make a name in the corporate world. He has occupied a place among the world's most powerful corporate executives. Thank you for coming over to the Millionaire's Business Wealth Secrets YouTube channel.